There have been uh, worrying rampant cases of human trafficking registered at Entebbe International Airport. We we'll recall that I think a few months ago we had a meeting here, we had the minister and a number of people, and we had an opportunity to interact with over 30 girls that actually have been saved. They had traveled to Dubai and other states, and actually they were being abused. About 75% girls and women have been allegedly trafficked through Entebbe Airport after being promised jobs abroad by traffickers, alleged to connive with some officers in the Ministry of Internal Affairs. As you are all aware, Uganda is a source, transit, and destination for, destination for human trafficking. This explains why trafficking is a challenge in Uganda, not only internally, but across the borders. We came knowing that there are agents, and we have put measures to fight agents, both legal measures in terms of prosecution and operational measures, which is digital. That's why we moved from manual processes to digital. The passenger traffic at Entebbe International Airport is said to have gone on rise since the easing of the lockdown. Because you can only make money when you have more people departing. So the risks are more now than they were during the COVID. And these numbers are continued to increase. That means the efforts that we have must be well, well placed. According to Olivia Birunji, the Deputy Director General, Civil Aviation Authority, the most common cases of trafficking have been mainly registered on young girls and women. In the last three years, over 200 suspects of human trafficking were arrested and arraigned before courts of law. It's alleged that traffickers have been conniving with some officials from Ministry of Internal Affairs to issue passports illegally. And that's why we are here today. We want through the digitized messages to reach out to all, from the highest to the most lowest, so that they are able to make informed migration decisions. While handing over the equipment to officials from Internal Affairs and Uganda Civil Aviation Authority, the Chief of Mission Better Migration Management, Sanusi Tajan, emphasized continued awareness creation on human trafficking. These tools will support in strengthening the national response and referral as well as we all work on the front line to end human trafficking in Uganda. TV screens, 14 UPS.